Usually occurring in February, the city decided residential snow removal was necessary, with Lloydminster seeing roughly one foot of snow already this winter. The warmer temperatures kept the snow from packing, leaving streets rutted. Temperatures uh, as we can uh, enjoy outside don't always make it conducive to the snow that happened. Uh, traditionally, we see a colder snow or a colder weather. The snow packs well in the street. Uh, we've received some warmer weather, which is nice to enjoy to be outside, but at the same time, it's resulted in that snow literally not packing. Work will begin on city streets north of Highway 16 before moving to other areas by Wednesday. Signage will be posted in areas 48 hours before clearing and the mayor is asking residents to move their vehicles off the streets. If the vehicles are removed, the grader can come along the sidewalk, do his job, and then the snow removal crew will do their job of getting the, the snow pile away. If they have to go around vehicles, you will see ridges and that just adds to it. They try to maintain some distance because we don't want to be damaging vehicles nor do people want their vehicles damaged. So you're going to be left with at least a foot ring around your vehicle. The city has budgeted for one snow removal a season, but they will pull out the plows again this winter if needed. It will be driven by Mother Nature. Uh, that's really what we can say. We don't. If uh, this is the snow for the winter, I would. In some ways, I'd be happy. I know the skidoers would like to see more snow, and I understand the cross-country skiers. But in the same token, we will deal with it accordingly as Mother Nature delivers it. The snow removal is expected to take four weeks, depending on the weather. Eric Bay, Primetime Local News.